So, you have some new X-Men for me? Yes, sir, I do. This is gonna be called The New Mutants. Uh, I don't know, I feel like they're gonna have to be clothed. No, new. Oh, okay, that's probably fine. Fantastic. So this is gonna start with this girl, Danny, right? And she's running away because something's destroying the reservation she lives on. Oh, boy. And her dad gets killed and she ends up bumping her head and losing consciousness. Yikes, that's not good. So she wakes up in this facility with this Dr. Reyes lady. And how's her concussion? Does she have any brain damage? No, this is the kind of head injury where you fall fall asleep for a couple of days and wake up with zero consequences. I don't, that's not a thing. Well, we're gonna pretend like it's a thing. Well, okay then. So anyway, now Danny is in this facility for young mutants, but nobody knows what her powers are. Okay. And the other mutants, they keep seeing things they're scared of show up for some mysterious reason. So Danny's power is that she brings people's fear to life? No. I feel like, I feel like that's probably what it is though, right? It's okay, okay, yes, but that's gonna be like a big reveal later. I don't think it will be. Well, can we pretend like it's gonna surprise people? We sure can. Pretending is super fun. Okay, great. So what else happens? Not much. Oh. Well, Danny's gonna really slowly get to know the other mutants, and that's that's pretty much what we're looking at here. Okay, and so how does that play out? Well, she's gonna meet this girl, Rain, and the camera's gonna linger for a second when they meet, so they're in love now. Oh, having the camera linger to show that two characters are now in love is tight. Yeah, it is. Anyway, so Danny and the other four mutants are gonna get to know each other by playing with a lie detector machine they find and asking each other questions. Don't they all know each other except for Danny? Well, right, but we don't know them yet, so they're gonna pretend like they don't really know each other in this scene. Well, okay then, so who are these other mutants? Well, Rain can turn into a wolf and she was beaten by a priest, but she's still religious. Okay. We also have this other mutant, Roberto, who accidentally burnt his girlfriend alive and he's just always doing dishes. Why is he always doing dishes? I don't know, I don't know. All right. There's this guy, Sam, who has like cannonball powers and accidentally killed his dad in a mine. Oh, uh, whoops. Whoopsie. Does he do dishes? He doesn't do dishes, no, so there's some good characterization going on here. I can see that. There's also this girl, Ileana, who was abused as a child and can go into this other dimension called Limbo and she is a dragon and she can teleport. Oh, whoa, sounds like she should be the main character. She's also overtly racist. Oh my god. Yeah, she's super mean with Danny. straight up tries to kill her at one point. Yikes, okay, and how come none of these mutants leave the facility? Well, there's a force field around this place. But Ileana can teleport, can't she just get out of there? Yeah, but no. Why? Because that works. Anyway, so at a certain point, Ileana's gonna roofie Reyes, so she falls asleep. How did she get roofies? Don't worry about it. So now that Reyes is asleep, the mutants can do whatever they want. Wait, this entire facility for dangerous mutants is run by one woman? That's what we're going with. Zero security guards. None. All right, so what do they do while she's unconscious? Oh, well, they dance, they play the tambourine, they play with a wheelchair, all very wacky stuff. Up. They don't go digging for information or try to escape. Oh, no, they go with the tambourine. Understandable, I guess. Tambourines are very fun. So yeah, they get to hang out with each other. It's all very fun. Was Rhea stopping them from hanging out? No, all she did was break up a fight in the last scene. They hang out constantly. Oh yeah, what happened with that? You said Ileana was about to kill Danny in the last scene. How are they friends now? Unclear. Well, okay then. So anyway, this whole time the mutants thought that maybe once they leave the facility, they're gonna go join the X-Men, right? Right. But then we're gonna discover that this place is actually run by Essex. Corp, which is a bad thing. Sounds bad. How do we find that out? Well, Danny gets to see inside Reyes' thoughts or something, and she's gonna see some clips straight out of Logan from that facility where the kids were, remember? Okay, okay, and since Logan takes place in the future, what does that mean in terms of timelines? Oh, well, sir, we are well past caring about timelines at this point. That's fair. And so eventually, Reyes is gonna get orders to kill Danny. Uh-oh. Yeah, and at the same time, people's fears start showing up even more violently, so they have to fight them. Wow, 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 wow. And Rain wow. rescues Danny from Reyes. Reyes, but then Reyes traps them all under force fields. Well, okay then. Is it gonna be tough for them to get out of the force fields? Actually, it's gonna be super easy. Barely an inconvenience. Oh, really? Yeah, a big giant demon bear bursts through the wall and kills Reyes, so that, 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 that works out. What? And then they're gonna have to fight this giant bear. That kid Roberto gets absolutely crushed. Oh, is he okay? Completely okay, yeah. Oh, good. And so then Danny's gonna manage to defeat the bear. How does she do that? Well, we're gonna have this whole thing going where Danny's dad told her that everyone has a bear inside of them and that's like your fear and it grows if you feed it so she's like hey stop stop it bear and that just that just kind of works oh well great and so now the new mutants are free and they're gonna head out and try to find the nearest town okay and so that's it we're done we're that's it oh so what do you think well it sounds like a great first episode i can't wait to see how the rest of the tv show plays out oh no that was a movie that was a movie yeah 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 oh really felt like a pilot episode okay yeah and i figure casting wise we can capitalize on things that are really hot right now you know get actors from game of 
Thrones, uh, Stranger Things, that movie Split. Oh uh, yeah, really leveraged those things at the height of their popularity. Man, we gotta get this thing out ASAP then. Oh, for sure, we can't delay. Hi, Ryan here. Thanks for watching that pitch meeting. Hope you liked it. Don't know why I said that all on the same note. If you did like the video, please share and like. That helps out a lot. And let me know in the comment section what movies you want to see pitches for. As always, check back soon for a new one. See you guys on the next video. Bye bye